This is a vote of confidence in Jacksonville's business climate. We are a city on the move, and the decision to combine operation here is adding to that momentum. Economic development has been priority one for my administration. That's why I've worked closely with Governor Rick Scott. This announcement came after a lot of hard work and collaboration by the state and local leaders. We're excited to celebrate the success with the local community and our state. The combined company will bring significant new capital investment and create jobs in our community. And as we welcome the Bilo family, I'm confident they're going to make this new venture even more prosperous and efficient. Their success will be our region's success. And I'm very happy to say that as a former certified meat cutter from Winn-Dixie, their headquarters will be in Jacksonville. Today we're here to welcome Bilo to my hometown of Jacksonville. Bilo is now a part of our great Sunshine State. With 100 new employees, they will enjoy the, what the current Winn-Dixie employees already enjoy here. No state income tax, a great quality of life, weekends on our wonderful, wonderful, beautiful First Coast beaches, and Sundays rooting for the Jacksonville Jaguars. <laughs> Bilo, which is now part of Winn-Dixie, will enjoy an increasingly favorable business climate with lower taxes and less regulations as well as government officials from local, from local to our state to the Congress that understands that jobs is job number one. For over 70 years, Winn-Dixie has not only met, meant quality for our area, but it has meant jobs. The collaboration between the state, the local community, to bring the new owner of Winn-Dixie brand to Florida is frankly historic for Jacksonville. This project exemplifies how the state the local community can work together seamlessly, can benefit all in the economy. For economic development process to keep the cornerstone company here of Winn-Dixie and bring a new partner to our city is monumental. Governor Scott has met with the Bilo team on several occasions to help solidify this deal because he realized immediately how important this project was for Florida. But it really was the personal involvement of the mayor and the governor uh, and our teams working together with the charge from both sides that we are not going to lose our headquarters here. And in fact, headquarters is one of our key targeted areas. So uh, we went through the process and uh, were successful and we congratulate the city uh, and uh, the state and we're very pleased on behalf of the business.